Three months ago, I was working on three different projects connected to D&D. Two of them in testing phases, one in early development. When the whole thing started, I stopped working on them. Now, when it's kind of over, I don't know what I want to do. I don't want to toss away several months of work, but I don't know if I feel comfortable supporting them anymore. Then there are the two new systems I was working on. One was built on top of the D20 system with its own world and some advanced mechanics. On the one hand, I wanted to build on a popular system so that people will have an easier time getting into the world. I wanted to use all the cool mechanics I thought of to make D&D better. Then this whole thing happened and I'm not sure I want my content to prop up the ecorp. So I was thinking let's go back to the human element, saverunner.itch.io slash the dash human dash element, but even that is kind of restrictive in its mechanics. Now it feels like it's not really condoning the really cool fun I want playing an RPG to be. Maybe it's part of it being generic, and maybe it's good that it's a small compact system that you can use anywhere. Then MCDM started working on their own RPG and got me really inspired to rethink everything from the ground up, and now I want to write my new world in a new system that imagines coolness as an inherent part of using it. Kind of board gamey, but still fun to roleplay. But if I do that, I imagine the default response will be, ugh, I don't want to learn a new system. Or I could wait and build an MCDM's RPG, which I assume would be free to use, and use that. It comes with a small but not insubstantial audience. And they have much more experienced designers on there, but that'll be six months to a year before we see anything tangible, and my brain is tingling with ideas already. What should I do? I would really appreciate any insight you have on the subject. Please comment down below with your thoughts.